Aloha, I'm Stan Cox II. I'm a photographic portrait artist. And you can see samples of my work all through my website. But right now, I'd like to share with you a short story. When I was growing up, I actually believed my dad was Superman. Yeah, THE Superman. Big S on his chest. Uh, could stop a speeding bullet, could stop a speeding locomotive with his bare hands, and could leap tall buildings in a single bound. Well, one reason why I believed that was because, well, he always wore dark tinted glasses, and he told me that they were to cut back on his x-ray vision. <laughs> he was a big guy. He had dark wavy hair, like Superman in the comic books and on TV. And he was a super dad. When I was about three years old, he rescued my three older siblings from the orphanage where their father had abandoned them. And he brought them home to live with us. He would take us all to Saturday matinees at the movies. He organized our family nights once a week, where we would all sit around and play a board game or watch a variety show on TV. He played the organ for the church choir. And he took us to picnics at Oak Park on Sunday afternoons. To me, he was Superman. Well, there was quite an age spread between us five kids. We were a close family, and a fairly uh, artistic one at that. Dad was a professional pianist. Mom enjoyed painting. My two oldest brothers and my youngest sister all played musical instruments. I always loved drawing and painting, and I discovered my passion for photography while in junior high school when an uncle gave me a big, beautiful Yashica twin lens camera. It was inspiring. I began my career as a professional photographer right out of high school as a stringer for a local newspaper. And I would photograph local school sports events. Then when I moved to Hawaii in my early 20s, I began photographing uh, young aspiring models and helping them with their portfolios tough job, but somebody had to do it, right? I completed the New York Institute of Photography Photographic Craftsman degree in 1982 via correspondence while living on Maui. Then the unthinkable happened. I got the call about 3 a.m. one morning. My dad the man I grew up believing was Superman had died. I never thought of mortality before, never thought about it. And it was only then that I discovered no one in our whole family had any copies of any portraits of the family. There had never been one made. That was when I decided to specialize in family portraits. You see, the tragedy is, my grandchildren will never know who my family was or what we looked like all together. Sure, there are snapshots, yellow and faded, of fractions of the family, but not even one snapshot of all of us together. And of course, you know, snapshots generally don't show people to their best advantage. While portraits, by definition, do. So, it has become my mission to help people to have a beautiful family portrait that will preserve the memory of their families for generations. And so that they won't have to suffer the loss of a family member, only then to find out that they have no portraits to remember them by.
It is my sincere desire to help you to have a beautiful family portrait of your own. Because portraits truly are family art treasures.